sovereign citizen do? That means, guys, you suck! Sovereign citizen from Israel. I know all about the gold bridge and how fraudulent it is. They hit me with a really strong dose of OC spray. I want to speak to you, Jess Rogers, now! I know the laws, buddy, and I'm waiting for you to do something wrong so I can sue you the pocket. I pay for that uniform, I pay for that car, I'm the taxpayer, right? Hi folks, I have two idiots for you today. The first one is called Cammed Up Caveman. A subscriber requested I do a video about him, and who am I to say no to one of my wonderful subscribers? Anyway, he has very urgent appointments at the hospital, but they're not more important than his desire to lie and harass people. Good morning, how may I help you today? Huh? How may I help you I'm today? deaf. Oh. I, I have an appointment for radiology. Oh, okay, yes. Huh? Just give me your hand for... I don't want that. I have sores on my hand that that will burn. Already he's lying. A thermometer cannot burn you. If it could, it wouldn't be very good at taking accurate temperatures, now would it? Um, you need it to wear the mask. The CDC says I'm not required to wear a mask. But we are in the hospital. So okay, well CDC is basically the, the health advisor for the country, right? Yeah, but I understand that they yeah. said they would okay. be back today at 8 p.m. No, no. They have to be at 8 p.m. today. I can't hear hear what you're saying. Because can you can you take that off so I can read your lips? No, they say that it's going to be at the, it's going to be at 8 p.m. today. 8 p.m. what? That you are uh you have the option to wear the mask or not. You have the option or the Russian? No, the option to wear the mask or not. From eight? Well, I, I, I don't, my appointment's before eight o'clock. But we received, okay. we received an email that the, the CDC said that it has to be today at 8 p.m. Okay, thank you. But see you, the operation is in the other way. Excuse me. Oh, excuse me, sir. The operation. Please don't touch me again. Okay. I can't hear you, so please don't. Sir, you need to step outside. Cause a I'm not trying to cause a ruckus. She is. is, and you are. You just followed me from the other entrance. Okay. Well, enjoy your work for today. We don't make the rules. We just try to follow. CDC made the rules. They said that I'm exempt. No, you're not. Yes, I am. Not in a private facility. You're not. That's their option. Again, we don't make the rules, we just try to... So are you refusing me service? I have no way to give you service. I okay, so shut the fuck up and sit down. No, sir, you're out of line. You're out of line. No, sir, sit I your ass not. down and do your job. I didn't come here to be harassed. I came here for medical treatment. No, you went there to harass people in an effort to try to get a few views for your pathetic channel. Nobody watches your channel, but don't worry. I'll make sure that plenty of people see your display of abject brainlessness. Then you need to follow protocols. We're trying to help you. Is it a law that says I have to wear a mask? Yes, no, no, there is it's not. There is not a law. It's a hospital policy. That's You're discriminating policy. against me because I refuse to wear a mask? You are ridiculous. You want to check and make sure I'm wearing underwear too? I have two pairs on, friend. I have an appointment for radiology and then um. blood work. Okay, so unfortunately, I'm going to have to get you to wear a mask before I let you... I, I can't wear a mask. I, I'm medically exempt for, according to the CDC. Do you have a card that says that? I don't need a card. There is no card. They don't pass out cards. The CDC put a, put a, a mass uh, pamphlet online that you can go on there and read. You should already know it. You should have already read it, actually. It's been a long time since I took statistics, but I think that the probability that 100% of First Amendment auditors having a medical condition that prevents them from being able to safely wear a mask is basically zero. It's much more likely that they're just liars. If you're going to try to enforce a law, you shouldn't actually, actually um, read up on the law. So or, we have a hospital policy here, okay, so Okay, we well, have to follow. Are you refusing me service? Are you refusing to allow me to get medically serviced here today? All I have to do is get you to put a mask on, sir. I can't wear a mask. All I have to do is get you to wear a okay. mask. Okay. Just put a mask on. When you get over there, they're going to need you to wear a mask also. Unfortunately, I can't let you in unless you have the mask on. So you are refusing me service. There's no law that says I have to wear a mask. 
we have right. you're discriminating you. against me because I don't have a mask right you're discriminating against my medical condition saying that I'm not allowed required to wear a mask correct I have a policy I have to enforce here at my job. Can I see your policy? Can I read your policy? I do not have a written one at the moment. I've got our screening questions that we have to ask, and then yeah. there are signs outside of the hospital. The signs don't really mean anything. That's not a law. That's not a statute. The signs require you to wear a mask here within the facility, sir. We have told you the signs. times that unfortunately you have to have a mask. So you're refusing me service? Yes. How many times do they have to say it? If that's what, because I cannot let you in without a that's mask. That's the only reason you're not serving me because I'm not having a mask on. How are you doing, sir? Are I'm you? doing fine. Let's go out here and we can talk and see what's going on. She's trying to tell me I have to wear a mask. I'm medically exempt. Okay, well, they're requiring it here in the hospital. So, so they're denying me service. Is that what they're doing? I believe so. If they're requiring you to wear a mask and they won't see you if you're not wearing one, then yes, they are denying you service. Is it a law saying that I have to wear a mask in the hospital? There's no law. They're discriminating against me. I, I have medical conditions that the CDC says exempts me from wearing a mask. Okay. Well, that's between you and the hospital. So. So you're upsetting employees and guests. You're upsetting me. Jesus, I can barely breathe. Okay. If you can barely breathe, then you should definitely be wearing a mask because that's a symptom. I need to go to medic get medical attention. Step with security, please, so we can help this isn't security, is it? Yes. This is a, officer. yes. Sorry. Do you so all want him to leave the facility? We're calling security now, so. I mean, look, the question is, are you going to see him without a mask or no, with a mask? that is not our policy. We have to have you wear a mask. So they're refusing service, correct? That's what it sounds like. Okay. It sounds like that to me. Can I get y'all's names? Your name, ma'am? Well, do you need medical attention? I have problems that are serious. My stomach is messed up bad. I shouldn't be having to tell you my medical conditions. No, I shouldn't have to be telling them. It's an emergency situation. Yes. Do you need medical attention? It's a rush. The, doc yes. the doctor actually gave me not only these two, two appointments today, I have four more appointments. Okay. Let's keep watching to see where his priorities are. Is he more concerned about his health? Or is he more concerned about making a video that thoroughly documents his deceitful harassment of innocent working people? My question is, do you need to see a medical personnel like right now? Is this a medical emergency that you are experiencing? I don't think it's an emergency. Okay. All right. But well, then it's up to the, the hospital's policy on whether or not policy they see is it. they have to wear a mask. Everybody has to wear a mask. You can't, he's not allowed to record either. Well, he can, it's a, it's a yeah, it's a public place. Can't record. For, That's legal. Yeah. They, they don't want people see you're enforcing things that you don't even know okay, i asked yeah. to read the policy okay, so, so that i can see the policy and they won't show so it the to the policy me. Is, is that everybody comes into this hospital i'd like to see your policy okay sir can we take care of the next people while you yeah can, while you security? go get the policy okay. and show so it to me that's that's this is completely ridiculous Okay, so do you need like medical attention right now, like this very moment? Oh, I'm hurting like a motherfucker. Okay. But uh, I hurt visit? every day, all day. Is it an ER visit is what I'm asking? I'm, it's not an ER visit. I need to get x-rays so that the doctor knows what surgeries okay. need to be done. And then it's up to the, the hospital at that point. To so can he show it. me the policy? Well, it's probably written in their SOP. Well, I haven't seen it. So, so question, I'd like to see it, to see if they, they are supposed to tell me i can't go in there required, that's a sign that means so nothing everybody wears a mask when they come into the you need to stop videotaping me my, my question is i'm not going to talk to him as long as he videotapes me well the hospital you're videoing me sir i'm allowed to i'm allowed to too well, the hospital okay see him without a mask at all or do they want him trust well, see you you people he, make up me, rules let me, let me answer him okay as soon as he comes in they're going to ask him to wear a mask okay and God, I gotta sit so down, man. I'm getting out of breath. Hold on, what? You've been saying that you're short of breath and cited that as the reason that you're at the hospital to begin with. Now you're acting as if it just started? To the hospital. My, my question is, will the facility at this point want him trespassed off the property or will they 
You can't trespass me unless I've broken a law. It's not a law to wear a mask. They can trespass you off the property if it's not an emergency. That's what I'm asking. That's they can't trespass me unless a law has been they can't violated. Do that. Yes, they can. Is there any posted signs here that says that's that this state, is private that's property? Law. That's a state law. They can trespass you as long as it's not a medical emergency. They can trespass you from the. I hospital. don't think that's correct. It is. I've, I've been doing this for 20 years. Okay. If, if they trespass you at that point, you have to leave. But we are trying to get them to that point. If they are going to trust, so you're trying to solicit a trespass. Is that to, what you're trying I'm to trying do? Trying to make a solution to this problem. Either they will. The see solution you. to the problem is either see me or don't. If they're going to refuse that, medical attention, they need to tell me they refuse medical attention. That's what I need. That's what I need. They've already told him multiple times that if he doesn't wear a mask, they won't see him. Are you refusing to give me medical no, attention, I'm not sir? Refusing to give you any medical. He refuses. You're to refusing to let me in to get he medical to attention. Stop videotaping too. But he wants sir, to... please go ahead and put the video away. You stop recording me and I'll stop recording you. How about that? I'm not going to stop recording to where you can make up lies and She's tell a, a judge manager. something. What? Right, so, sir, can you just put it on pause for just a second and talk to me, please? Can you just turn it No, off? I'm not turning my camera off because you're sitting here trying to make up rules and, and trying just, to enforce a trespass that... I just walked up, okay? Give me two seconds he, to figure out what's going on. He's not going to wear his mask. We want to know. I can't. The CDC says I don't have to wear a mask. Are you going to make an exception to see him without his mask? Your name, sir? Okay, or are they going to remove him? Your name, sir? I'd like to figure out what he's here for. Your name, sir? That's what my name is. What's your name, sir? I'm partially deaf Redmond. and I have vision problems. Whitman? Redmond. Redmond? This is Officer Redmond. Badge number? I'm Sergeant Wainwright. Yes. Is that what Sergeant saying? Wainwright? Yes, sir. Your name, sir? Howard? No. I can read that. She wants to know what your medical condition is so that you, you know, whether what are you, or not you what are you here? Are you here? To I'm see? here for radiology and blood work. My doctor sent me okay. because I need we surgery. Have, we have an emergency room if you need emergency care. If you're just here for a test, we would ask you to please wear a mask. That is the hospital policy. We do see, you're asking me and I decline. Yes, I'm asking you to wear a mask. I decline. Okay. We can refuse so you're refusing you to allow me the medical. To come in if you don't wear a mask. I'm allowed or not allowed? Is what I didn't hear you. I'm partially deaf. You're, you're, if you're refusing to wear a mask, we can refuse the service to have you come. In. Who are you? Are you security? Yes, sir. Okay. What's your name? I'm Kyle. Kyle. Yes, sir. Okay. Your name is? I don't have to tell you my name. It would just be better than just calling you sir all the time. Well, that's fine. You can yeah. call me sir. Are since... you Anthony? Are you yes, Anthony? I'm Anthony. Okay. Thank you, Anthony. Give me um a minute. Okay. to make a phone call, and I will... Okay, sounds good. CDC is the one that makes the guidelines. The CDC doesn't set policies for individual hospitals. CDC only sets guidelines, which are essentially recommendations. For the hey, whole country. Sir, you can fuck off until you shut that camera off. Thank you. You want me to do something, you do it. You want me to treat you with respect, you treat me with respect. We're trying to find out if the hospital will see you without a mask. That's the question. And if they will not, then they are refusing you care for non-emergency reasons. They can do that at this facility. Okay. And at that point, you will have to leave. And that that's fine. That's fine. That's all but they're going to have to tell me that they refuse to medically treat me. Okay. Because I'm, I'm, sh I'm sure there's laws being, being broken for the ADA, Americans with Disabilities Act. I'm sure you knew what I meant. All right, Anthony. We got a um, couple options here. Okay. Okay. For you to come into radiology, you must either wear a mask or a face shield. I meant to mention earlier that they gave him the option of wearing a face shield rather than a mask. That pretty much nullifies his argument that he can't wear a mask due to medical exemptions. Because it is something that you can get. It's not emergency treatment. It's something that you can get somewhere else. You have the option to go somewhere else to get your radiology and your blood work. Okay, so those are our two options. You wear a mask, face shield. We're more than happy to provide the services. If not, we need you to go ahead and leave the process. Okay. Right, Have a nice day. Thank you all. All right. Thank you, Anthony. What was your name, ma'am? My name's Denise. Denise? Okay. Yes, Have a nice day.
it must really shatter these people's worldview when they use all of their magic words and still don't get what they want. Next up we have Carolina Swamp Fox. You've probably seen her in other videos of mine where she's getting arrested with her cousin's son. In this video she's at a dialysis center being a Karen until she ends up in cuffs. Or as she wrote, she ends up in handcuffs. Let's take a look. And here comes the popo. He wants to walk on the one where they don't have the camera. Hey, how are y'all doing? Name and badge number. What does that look like? 224B. And your card? You got to show your card too. I, I don't have to show a card. Yes, you do. It's in your all policy. I, I got the policy. I got the policy. All I have to do is give you my name and badge. No, in the policy I also says you have to show your card. Okay, I can show you the policy. I can. What I got it printed out too. What, what is it that y'all have going on out here? What's it look What's like we're like? doing? You don't, you don't have to be like that. You got to call Saint John. Okay. Okay. I ain't gonna stay nowhere. And I'm gonna tell I'm not detained. Go fuck yourself. That reminds me, there's no way that I could possibly edit out all the language that YouTube will take exception to, so they're just going to have to demonetize this one. What's that? If you pass out here again, that's the story. No, no it's not. You can't, you can't make it just a story. Come up to you. It is. No, it ain't. No, it ain't. No, it ain't. All out here, they No, 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 you people all out here, I said it to you. Watch your language. Watch your language. You better call your damn supervisor. You better call your damn supervisor. That is, I, I, Fifth Amendment, hey, First Amendment. I have your damn badge too, asshole. I don't have to watch my language to the officers. No, we do not. Get your supervisor right here. I want a supervisor right now. I want a supervisor right now. Supervisor, you ain't explaining shit to me. Supervisor, right now. How embarrassing would it be for you if this was your mother or grandmother? Keep in mind, too, that she's at a dialysis center. Imagine going to get dialysis and you see Edna Clampett in the parking lot screaming at the police. Name and badge number. Yeah. Name and badge number. Your Name your badge number. Name and badge number. Name, excuse me. Get your supervisor. I request the supervisor. Now get him out here. Don't call my lawyer. Cause these assholes don't know what they're doing. How about one him? Supreme How Court? About Supreme Court don't rule. The F word is not abusive language. And I can cuss y'all out how I want to. I can't do it out in public. Call your supervisor. Call your supervisor. Call him. I request it and I want it. Car 29 and car 60, 65. I'll be coming down doing a report on y'all. A complaint. You cannot get disorderly conduct on yourself. They has to be a complainer. And you are not the complainer, dumbass. And when I do that complaint, I'm also going to put down in there where y'all ain't showing y'all slack card when you're supposed to. I have the policy. Matter of fact, call Droolis. Tell the swamp foxes out here to tell you to leave me the hell alone. I want Droolis. Call Droolis. Make sure they can see my sign. Don't say nothing, though. They want you to leave the property, okay? We're not on their property. No, we're not. Get Droolis out here. No, it ain't. This is public easement. You see that sign over there? You see that thing right there? This is public easement. Get Droolis down here. Get Droolis. No, it's not. No, it's not. Good. He'll teach you something. Because this is public easement, dumbass. Okay. I'll tell you about that I can cuss you all I want to. Go ahead. And you put I'm telling you to stop cussing. Well, you can't tell me to stop cussing. Yeah. Dang, nobody did. I just said this is school. It's Saturday. It doesn't matter. Can y'all hear me? No. No matter. Oh, we'll see. 
I told you we'll four see. times. We'll see. Stop cussing. And they be and, oh, and, you, and you I got in jail. And this, I can use what I want you to. to. You, you, you work so you for me. I can cuss at you all goddamn while I want to. Right. I, I, I do know. work for you. That's right. That's right. Yeah. And the Supreme Court says right. we can right. cuss at y'all as long as we want to. Yes, it is, dumbasses. It's not Who's the complaining? Uh uh. You ball. Not just the supervisor. Not GC supervisor. Put hands on your back. Nah. I'm not asking. I'm not asking. Grab that dog, get it. Put your hand behind the back. Put your hand behind the back. I'm not. Y'all know y'all doing this. Y'all know y'all doing this unlawfully. Y'all, y'all are doing this unlawfully. Y'all are doing this unlawfully. That's right. Y'all don't have the right to do that. Yes, you do. Y'all do not have the right to do that. There's another pop pop. That better be the supervisor. That better be the supervisor. That ain't my dog. That's a supervisor. That ain't my dog. Get my dog gone. And they're going to they gonna, gonna lose your immunity for this. Because I've already been arrested for this and dropping. But I'm my record, you dumb motherfucker. Sadly, they eventually let her go but I'm sure she'll be back out there screaming at the police and getting arrested again real soon. Well, if her family aren't feuding with the Hatfields, that is. If you like this video and you want to see more stupid in the future, please like and subscribe.